This is Drunk on Your Love by me and Brett Eldridge. Brett Eldridge performed and sang this song like no other. He's the best there is and one of my best friends. Wrote this song over 10 years ago with Brett before we knew anything about what we were doing. We were just writing songs and having fun and and we just made this uh, in, in my living room together. I remember we, we found this uh, accordion sound in Sample Tank that we just thought was so funny that we, funnily enough, ended up using on like everything we did. And this song started with that. This accordion musette. We just loved the way it cut through and it just inspired us. And it's not perfect. I mean, it's very imperfect. And you just add these these claps, which it looks like I actually recorded these claps in the room that day, so that's probably me and Brett clapping. And there's also like these congas happening, which we also got obsessed with back then. It's fun for me to, to re-look at these songs because I haven't looked at them in so long, and so um, this is going down memory lane for me, but just love the way that feels. I remember Brett saying drunk on your love and I feel like he just started singing over this track. He just started going. I woke up, up still drunk, drunk on your love, love on your love, love, love. Now I know why I'm feeling so high, high, cause I'm still drunk, drunk. Saved the acoustic until the top of second verse, which is which is cool. I, I love that we just built to that. I want to hear the? It sounds like my old Taylor guitar. Now this one I actually did mic up because um, we would have been kind of we would have been making these tracks, and they also were turning into records at, in those days. And so out in the wind, the, the acoustic comes in with the piano. Oh, sorry, that's a a whirly. No piano in this song. We got the accordion and the whirly happening. It gets me fumbling, always stumbling the, through uh, a head. Addictive drums kit. They do the kick starting on the top of the second verse. And stacked up Brett's vocals um, here. Not too much, but just double and up and up and two BVs. I woke up for Brett. And Brett, Brett was always so good at singing still is his own background vocals um so he he was singing all those um very simple track again it's a simple idea there's not much happening here oh wish i could bite on you up and drink you in all day long every day singing this song i woke up Such a simple chorus. It's like two lines stretched out over the length of the entire chorus. I just love that. I, I just have always loved this song for its simplicity and just the way it makes me feel. Um, I woke up drunk on your love. Come on, that, that's like such a beautiful thought. Um, Brett's, Brett's such an incredible artist with such incredible vision and, and uh, these days were so fun when we get, got to make these records together and just just me and him writing a song. Some of my favorite writes are two ways, because um, you can really just collaborate with that person. And you uh, sometimes when there's three or four people in a room, you have to do your best at finding your place. But when it's two people, you each are just fully in it together. And you're going back and forth, and it's 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 uh, it's really engaging and invigorating. And um, and that's how I felt about those days with Brett and. This is Drunk on Your Love. These are the these are the raw tracks. I hope you have enjoyed this.